Hello everybody, my name's Eternal Symmetry and I am back, hopefully, to streaming. Um, I'm going to be checking my audio before I explain where I've been. I see you, Blue Eyes White Boomer. Welcome to the stream and thank you for being here. I appreciate it. Um, hello, Amunet. All the stars and kitties wishing for some biddies are looking so pretty and also so smart and witty. <laughs> Welcome to the stream, Amunet. Um, I'm about to check my audio. This is a test stream, so it's probably going to be a little shorter than my usual, like, two hours. It might be, like, an hour or so, or a little more, something like that. But I just want to make sure my computer is working. Rock Tree, thank you so much for resubscribing. 12 months? Rock Tree, that's a whole year. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Um, okay, you guys can let me know. I'm going to check my audio, but... Uh, feel free to let me know if something's not working, if something sounds weird, if something looks weird. Um, it took me so long to set everything back up, but I'm going to explain that. But let me just uh, check my audio real quick. Are you muted? I was muted. Uh, it sounds like my game audio is a little loud. So let's turn that down a bit. Okay. Uh, let me know if you guys can hear me or if you can hear like um, anything. Okay. 
Thank you so much for um, trying to shout people out. It doesn't look like it's working, but that is why, that is why I wanted to do this test stream, so. And I figured Animal Crossing was so chill. It was like the perfect game to do a test stream for. Okay, so let me try to fix that. That is this over here. But yeah, this is just, um, this is just a test stream, guys. So. But I appreciate everyone who's here and who's showing up. What am I hearing? I'm hearing things happening. Rodri, thank you so much. I appreciate that. I do have a little um, uh, bit donation goal going on, guys. It is something that's just there. It's nothing I'm going to be promoting, really. It's just there. But I, um, if you haven't heard the news, I am going to be getting married. So um, as you probably know, weddings are expensive. And I'm probably... Um, not gonna be able to afford everything by myself so any any donations um, are very much appreciated cloudbot turn back on there you there we go that sh okay so shout outs should be working now uh, let me know if they're still being uh, mean and lazy and bad Rockfree, thank you so much I appreciate that hello chef I see you thank you guys for being here I I really do uh, it does mean a lot to me I, I feel like I say I appreciate it too much. Sorry, YouTuber glitched. YouTuber is back at it. Um, Rock Treat, thank you so much. I appreciate that. Um, but yeah, okay, so guys, I worked on this island a little bit. Let me know how the audio is. I did turn down the game audio uh, because the wind is a bit loud. The goal percentage works. Yes, I'm happy everything's working. Let me know if you want me to make it a little bigger. Um, or the goal. I didn't want it to be too big because it, again, it's just something that's there and if you guys want to donate, you're more than welcome to, but it's not anything I'm pushing so I didn't want to make it too big like, make it take up the whole screen <laughs> so, um uh, okay, so I found some babies uh, they're beautiful I'm gonna, I want to set up like a little stage and uh, have them like just do their thing on it I think that will be cute. But guys, this is our streaming island. I did work on it a little bit. Uh, so it is still a mess. It is a royal mess. But we have a few new villagers who moved in. I don't know how much you guys remember, but I had everyone living on the... Oh, let me open the map. This actually might help me explain a little bit. I had everyone living on the beach, uh, for the most part, um, where I could fit uh, houses on the beach, at least. Um, okay, so these are our, our villagers. Uh, Raymond was already here. He, I, was he our first campsite guy? I don't remember. But he was here. Uh, Hazel is one of our starters. So she was here when we first moved in. I used my amiibo to, um, to move her in. And correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe it's pronounced Ion. Ion. Um, I believe that's an I and an L. But I'm not sure. Um, let's see. Bill was one of our starters. Blue Eyes White Bloomer, thank you so much. Thank you so much for gifting a tier one sub to, I, I believe it's Lava Girl. Um, she, oh, she's like a newest streamer, so shout outs to her. She plays Lost Stardew Valley. Thank you so much, Blue Eyes White Bloomer. I appreciate it. Um, okay. Camel Frog, I, I found on an island. So I was playing this a little bit by myself because I, I wanted to push it forward, push it along. I, <laughs> it's taking way too long for me to be. Uh, doing the tutorial, so to speak, of um, Animal Crossing. But it does take a while. Uh, Apple, I don't remember where she came from, but she's here. Uh, Cephalobot, I moved in with an amiibo. Mo, he's here. I don't remember where he came from. Savannah, she auto-filled. So she, I think she's from another island, but I'm not sure. And Zell, I don't remember where he came from, but he's here as well. So I believe this is all, all we can have for... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, so I believe you can only have ten villagers. Uh, and I want to say you can have up to four uh, human players living on an island, but I don't know if that's true. I know you can have at least two. Guys, thank you so much for being mods and shouting people out. I appreciate it. And, and for all the gift subs and uh, the bits, I appreciate it. A million percent. Um, I'm a little worried about my audio, so let me just be unprofessional one more time and check my audio.
Okay, sounds good. I did turn it down a bit. Because I know the uh, the wind... Let me just adjust my mic. The wind, uh, in this game at least, it gets loud. And I, they, I think Nintendo did that on purpose because it's like supposed to be like real wind is loud when it rustles through trees. They were pretty proud of the wind. I remember when they were when they were like advertising this game. They they specifically talked about the wind. So, all right, um, sparkles, yay, sparkles, yeah. I have some uh, commands in chat that I they're on my channel somewhere in my about section. I do a bunch of cute faces and stuff. Okay, let's see. What did we find? A bamboo shoot lamp. I don't think I have that. But yeah, guys, I will do a little tour of the island. That is a mess. Audio is so good. Thank you guys so much for letting me know. What, what am I? Am I missing something in chat? May 16th at 11.30 a.m. You say sus. Wait, what? I have no idea what you're talking about. Oh, oh, you're talking about... Okay, well... Guys, I am a time traveler in Animal Crossing. This is not the right time. Unless I'm from the future. Which, you will never know if that's true or not. <laughs> I could be uh, from the future. I don't know what this is. I put this on the island. So I decorated my island with a, with a bunch of random stuff. There's no theme going on. Because I don't have... Um... Five star, no, not five star island. Okay, so if you guys don't know the tutorial of the game, it's basically get your island, or do what Tom Nook says, uh, our supreme ruler Tom Nook, do what he says, um, and then he wants you to get a KK Slider concert going on. So, so you do what he says up until you get that KK Slider concert, and then you're allowed to do whatever you want on your island. Well, you're allowed to do whatever you want anyway, but it's kind of like a tutorial thing you have to follow. Um, and Isabel is also there, and she tells you how to get your island up to three stars. So that's what you need. I believe it's three stars. So it's it goes from one to five star islands. And mine is like a two star right now. So one of the things that she uses to evaluate your island is stuff. Is there enough stuff, like, on your island? Um, so I just put, like, random stuff everywhere. Uh, items and stuff. Plot twist, it's really May 16th and you're late with all your responsibilities. <laughs> um, this is a little pig uh, farm. It's like the only thing I actually tried to decorate, but it's not going to stay there. It's just something I thought was really cute. I saw like a picture or something. I don't remember where I saw it. Facebook or Instagram or something. I don't remember. Um, of someone who made a little pig farm and I love pigs. I think they're so cute. So these are piggy bank items. And I, I just put them on there like a little pig farm. So I thought that was cute. Uh, er everything over over this way is all like nothing. There's nothing over here. So I'm not even going to walk over there. There's nothing up the hills yet. Um, this is our museum. Oh yeah, this. <laughs> okay, so this right here is the store. And back behind here is where I steal Tom Nook's Wi-Fi and I and I do and I stream. He hasn't noticed yet, so don't tell him. <laughs> don't tell him um, that I steal his Wi-Fi and I stream behind his store. <laughs> so that's what I do back here. Um, my my character, by the way, has has a way better setup than I do in real life. I'm like looking at my setup right now. Uh, is not anything like that. But anyway. Here's like a Ferris wheel item. It's just decoration. I wish your characters could like um, ride it, but they can't. A lighthouse. But yeah, there's just a, a bunch of random stuff everywhere. It looks like the time is, is the time change? No, it's just like the audio gets quieter when you get towards the ocean, which makes sense. Um, a little like, a uh, little, I don't know, food place. <laughs> You can cook in this game, too. It's one of the newer update things, but um, my character can't do it yet. Some more villagers are banished that live on the beach forever and ever and ever. Uh, until I get terraforming, which I don't have yet. Um, this is a plaza. It's beautiful. Um, more random stuff, which hopefully will help... Um, my island become better in Isabel's eyes. Hello, Camo Frog! Eternal Sim! Hey, Eternal Sim! 
So Eternal Symmetry didn't fit, so my name's Eternal Sim. <laughs> so how's it so how's it feel being the talk of the island right now? Where does you've been trying to get KK to stop by this place on his latest concert tour? Don't know if you knew this, but I'm a big KK fan myself. Yeah, everyone is apparently. If you actually manage to get KK to do a show here on our island, I'll be one happy frog. There's a Pokemon chat, guys. To show what I mean to show I mean business, take this. I can read, guys. Actually I can't, I'm lying. <laughs> Your idea is to boost this place so it'll get noticed by KK, right? I wonder if something like my garbage can here might help. Uh, camera frog. <laughs> camera frog. A garbage can. You think KK Slayer gonna, gonna be like, Wow, I gotta visit this island. I got one great garbage can. Thanks, camera frog. I hear their garbage can is, is wonderful. Well, let me put it down. Um... I, oh, I also have a lot of stuff in my pockets, apparently. Here's our garbage can. Here's our garbage can to attract uh, KK Slider to our um, island, according to Camo Frog. I wouldn't go to TwitchCon either. Sounds expensive. Wait, what? If I was a Twitch pro... I'm reading chat the wrong way. Also, sorry for a small promo message, but even though I live on the west side of the USA, I'm not going to TwitchCon. I just got an email about it, so I figured I would get that out there. If it was... If it was Twitch Pro, however... Oh, okay. You guys are talking about TwitchCon. I, I don't have the money to even try to go to TwitchCon. That's 1k. Oh. <laughs> You're right. Boys, like, boy. <laughs> you are right. Uh, okay, so... I actually have to sell this stuff, so... If I remember correctly. I was playing this last night. Um, all this stuff is already donated in the museum, so they don't take uh, duplicates, so... I'm just gonna sell it. Because I have a lot of money called zero money. <laughs> also, guys, I added a timer. Uh, you guys can probably notice it uh, in the Pokeball. Uh, it it tells it counts down to when the next Pokemon spawn is gonna be, and it seemed to work when I saw that. What was that? What was that Pokemon? Panpour. Panpour? Water Monkey. Uh, it seemed to work, so that's there now. And also, I put Pokemon font for the. Uh, Estimation point, Poké Star, and whatnot. Hello, Kitty Tetra. Welcome to the stream. I appreciate everyone showing up. This is a test stream. I'm just showing off my my really beautiful island. <laughs> my, my super Instagram uh, worthy island. <laughs> but welcome to the stream. Eventually, in probably like three years, it'll get... No, I'm just kidding. I'm, I'm exaggerating. Eventually, I hope to get it to where it's like actually an island <laughs> that's worthy of uh, looking at. Uh, oh, yeah, and the store upgraded, guys. So last time I, I streamed this, the store wasn't upgraded. I don't remember if I'm forgetting to tell you anything. Um, okay. Tess is passing flying colors so far. Yay, I'm so happy. So Oh, I forgot to explain. I... Uh, Where's my brain? It's all over the place as usual. So guys, I didn't stream for like two weeks um, or something like that because my computer decided it didn't want to work anymore and it was broken. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> wait, this is a test I didn't study. It's okay, Blizzard right, Boomer, I didn't study either. <laughs> I was just, I was just winging it. Um, so my computer decided it didn't want to work anymore. And I tried, well, okay, so before um, I realized what was going on, I was trying to stream and everything was lagging. Nothing was working. VTuber showed up, but like it was glitchy as I have my mic too close to my mouth. Um, it was on the screen, but like when I moved like this, it was like doing this. Oh, wait. When I want it to glitch, it doesn't do it. Oh, never mind. It's working too well now. Now it doesn't want to glitch. Well, it was like doing its glitch thing that you guys have seen before. But it was worse because the actual, like, VTuber was, like, it had, like, lines, it, like, glitchy lines on it and stuff. And I was like, what is happening? And the stream was, like, I didn't hit start streaming, so I wasn't actually streaming. But OBS was, like, lagging. My computer was lagging. I had no audio on my monitor, and I thought it was a monitor problem, but it turns out it was actually my computer. So what we ended up having to do is, I didn't know what was happening, so I just... Not factory set it, but um, recovery reset it or something. So it kept all my files, but it deleted all my applications. So when I, um, how many bells do you have? I have a whole zero. Rock tree. <laughs> 
if you're talking about my pocket, at least. Um, what was I saying? Oh, so I got my, so delete all my applications, and I, uh, let me sell this stuff while I'm talking. And, um, so I had to, so I had to reset up OBS. Yeah, that's the perfect, oh, look, SiriBot has its own table flip. That's funny. I, so when you do exclamation point flip, you flip two tables. <laughs> It's perfect. I'm keeping it. Um, but yeah, so I had to set up OBS all over again. And it's not... So it's different from... So if you stream from uh, Streamlabs OBS... Or I don't know. They took the OBS out of their title. Streamlabs. Um, Rocktree was telling me when he switched computers, it saved all his like setup and everything. Well, because I use OBS and it's all from my computer and it's not in any cloud or any website or anything... Um, I had to set it all up manually again, so I lost everything, so I had to set it up manually again. So what you're seeing might change a little bit as in terms of like my, my starting screen and my end stream and screen and whatever. That might change. That was just kind of thrown together yesterday, because it, and it took me forever to do, by the way, uh, because I had to do it all again. So that is kind of where I've been. I've been dealing with... I'm just going to sell everything. I've been dealing with computer stuff, and I apologize, but I appreciate you guys, uh, ooh, 45, 45,000 bells, I'll take it, um, I appreciate your patience, and I appreciate you sticking around, I appreciate you guys showing up, it means a lot to me, it really does, um, but yeah, I announced it on Discord, and I believe I announced it on Twitter, ban in game action, having bells, <laughs> Does that mean I can't buy this melon soda? It looks delicious. <laughs> Can I not buy this melon soda because it costs bells? All right, I'll get rid of my bells. Um, but that's working. So thanks for um banning something, Rock Treat, so I could see that was working. Uh, okay. So let me catch up on chat. Came really close to chickening out when, when it was down to about six ounces worth. Wait, I'm not sure what you're talking about. I mean it. We were able to make more. Let me scroll up and chat. I was at work waiting for a U.S. food truck and explaining to customers why they couldn't have turkey and roast beef for about an hour. Guess you could say we had to ham it up for a while. <laughs> I'm glad you weren't chicken in that situation. Oh my gosh. <laughs> not everything is in the cloud, but yeah, that's one downside of standalone OBS. Yeah, I'm not sure. Honestly, don't know. So I'm really not tech savvy, guys. So I don't even know why... Streamlabs saves all your stuff? I don't know. I don't I don't understand it. I'm old. Um I know you're paying eternal. I went through that too last year. Yeah, it was just uh, you know what? I didn't mind setting everything back up on OBS because I was happy my computer was working. So if I had to choose between setting everything back up on OBS and my computer being dead, I, I I'll I'll set everything back up on OBS and hope my streams work. I, I'll i I'll choose that. <laughs> You are tech savvy. Oh yeah, but you're a boomer. Yeah, you actually are blue eyes white boomer. You helped me with my um. I remember you helped me with my um. Ocarina of Time. I lost all my files. I didn't know where it was. Blue eyes white boomer actually helped me with that. Uh, having bells, buy it and buy your money. Wait, Rodri, buy it and buy your money. What are you talking about? How do you buy money? How do I wait? You banned having bells, so I got it. I'm gonna go put that in the. I'm gonna put my bells. I can either throw them on the ground or put them in the, um... Oh, bury your money. Oh, okay. <laughs> you want me to bury my money? Okay, I'll bury my money. Um, but I don't think a money tree will show up because, uh... You have to bury your money in a glowing... Or uh, a glowing spot or whatever. I don't know. How do you buy money with money? <laughs> okay. Rockfree banned having bells and wants me to bury my money, so that is what we're doing. And I guess this is a good test, because I don't actually know if a tree is going to grow, so let's find out, because I think a tree only grows in a glowing spot. I I'll bury as much as it lets me. Um, so let's see. Bury. No. Okay, so, if you just bury your bells, it doesn't become a tree, but if you barrier bells I'm gonna have to put that in the actual thing but if you bury your bells in a glowing spot it turns uh, into a tree and when you don't bury your bells in a glowing spot it turns into 
whatever that is, star thing. <laughs> if anyone wants to trade Monopoly money with real money, <laughs> let me know. <laughs> I actually, I'm look, um, next to me, I have Animal Crossing New Horizons Monopoly set. It's not open because no one wants to play Monopoly with me. <laughs> but I do have that. Um, okay, so I gotta put this in here. Not a lot, of, okay, so now I have bells. Uh, I'll deposit my, uh, 517. There you go. <laughs> this is how many savings, uh, or bell savings I do have. It looks like a lot, but once I start moving houses and building bridges and paying for inclines and whatever else I gotta do in this game, uh, it'll go away quickly. Oh no, I wanted to ask Isabel what my rating was. That's a big saving sus. Rock Tree is saying I'm cheating at this game. Cop, cop. Why would I ever do that, cop, cop? I don't have a command for sus. <laughs> Should I have a command for sus? <laughs> I think there's a sus sticker. Okay. But it's like a Christmas one. Hello, Isabelle. What is my island rating? Oh, Eternal Sim, good morning. How can I help you today? Uh, let's talk island evals. So you're curious about the current image of Galaxy. And now Galaxy has a two star rating, so it did go up a star. It was a it was a one star. <laughs> you added one for sus. I love it. I love it. There's some positive buzz floating around about our island. Folks are starting to take notice. Allow me to read an excerpt from the feedback I gathered. It's like when a snow person is built just right. Sure it's a good thing to be well made and and to feel the love. But I don't know what a snow but I don't know that a snow person would get the proper attention here. That's my take anyway. Oh, okay. Well there you have it. So she like takes like um reviews and quotes from different characters in the game, and I guess that one was from a snowman. <laughs> if I'm reading these reports correctly, people think the island's natural environment has a lot of potential. Let's get more greenery on this island by planting fruit and saplings. When it comes to- oh, more trees? I have so many trees going on. When it comes to tree varieties, we should really- oh my, we really should branch out. What is- Isabel is turning into Blue Eyes White Boomer now. And- and Amunet, <laughs> apparently. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I just can't resist such low-hanging fruit. Help, I gotta leave. <laughs> right back to business. <laughs> and there you have it. Just let me know next time you'd like to hear the latest island feedback. Uh, can I help with anything else? Um... Guys, so I don't... Did I change island tune? I don't remember. Uh, so I still don't have an island flag. If anyone has this game and you want to design one for me, uh, let me know. Just don't make it a butt or something. <laughs> Just don't make it something... <laughs> you know what I mean. <laughs> don't make it something that'll get me in trouble with Twitch. Please. Okay. Um. So I have no money. Uh, I don't think I need to talk to Tom Nook. Uh, don't tell him about me stealing his Wi-Fi. He doesn't need to know that. <laughs> Also, fun fact, that was a legit answer in Jeopardy. It was great. Wait, what was the answer in Jeopardy? Sus? Was sus an answer on Jeopardy? <laughs> Alright, um, so I have no bells, so I can't go shopping. I have no bells, right? Yeah. Uh, let's talk to Apple. Good morning! I don't, I don't ever read their little, like, catchphrase thing. Because they say it too much. I was like way into this walk, but then it started to get boring. Then I found you and it's fab again. Oh, okay. <laughs> attention span. <laughs> attention span like mine, apparently. Um, okay. Uh, what was it? I have no plan. I never checked my mail. Happy Home Academy. Oh, yeah. I got to show you my house. <laughs> so I redesigned my house. Last time we played, I only had one room. No, I had like one room which was the main room now i have like an extra room um, an actual room let's check it out and you guys if you hear me muting my mic which you will i'm just coughing i don't i don't like coughing in the mic so it is dark in here but i but i have it dark because wow star wallpaper Oh, and Rock Tree, you said earlier that you should play this game again? Yeah, I highly recommend it. I actually took, like, I haven't played it for, like, two months. Are you still coughing? Yeah, I constantly cough. I don't know what's going on. I mean, uh, but, yeah, so let me turn on a light. This is my... You're concerned? Oh, I appreciate that. I'm okay. I don't know what's wrong with me. Um, this is my little, uh, 
house. It, ha it needs a lot of work. Uh, I set everything up and realized I don't have a couch, so I have this chair here. <laughs> it's fine. We don't need a couch. Uh, okay, um... Should I go buy Pokemon cards? No! No, Rocktree, you should not. <laughs> Rocktree's been spending a lot of money on Pokemon cards, that is why I'm telling him no. So this is uh, where you get food. I have a whole buffet in my house, apparently. Uh, if you want toast, it's there. There's a Pokemon chat. Yes! Okay, so the countdown did work. It's a Feeboss, guys. That evolved. It looks ugly, but it evolves into a really pretty Pokemon. Uh, scrapbook. So yeah, this is my house. Okay, so... Uh, fair warning, the back the back room in my house has some kind of a story to it. I just don't know what it is, but maybe we can find out together. <laughs> maybe we can find out together what's going on in this room. I set it up. I set it all up, and I was like, hmm, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Okay, so it looks dark. But it looks dark because um, I think the floor is really cool when you walk on it. If you listen carefully, it, it has like a little... Um, noise like a little bell noise but I don't know if you can hear it because I don't know if my audio is loud enough but yeah okay so <laughs> I don't know what's going on in this room let me turn on the light uh so <laughs> I, I wish I could say I can explain but I I, I really can't so in this tube there is um, a skeleton I do not know if they were alive when they went in the tube, but they are a skeleton now. Uh, there's a sword here, which I believe might have belonged to the skeleton. Uh, and there's like a magical um, uh, pond. And when I push on it, it does a cool thing. Um, bye, Fiba. See you later. Uh, and there's like a, um, a sleeping chamber pod here. The skeleton is sleeping. So the so there's a sleeping chamber pod here and I don't know like I don't know if it, if that skeleton is like me. I just I'll just lie down. So is that skeleton actually my real body and like I'm a clone? Is that what happened? Is that what my room is trying to explain? Like I set it up and I was like, there's a story here somewhere. <laughs> I just don't know what it is. And then when, this is really cool though, when you get out of the bed, it's like, whoosh. Okay. <laughs> but yeah, this is my bedroom. It's completely normal. Um, very normal. Very, very normal. But yeah. <laughs> and that's my house. It is very small right now. Not much going on in it. Not much to see. I love this wallpaper. There's actually a galaxy floor too. Which I think I have. But I didn't set it up because it didn't look right. There it is. And I love it. It's it's one of my favorites. Place on the floor. There we go. Woo, stars. I love it. It actually does look nice. I wish I had a I wish my room in real life could look like this. Like, have the stars on the wall and the stars on the floor, and it looks kind of like has some depth to it. It's really cool. <laughs> Alright, um, so yeah, that's my house. It's beautiful. And storage. Maybe we'll design a house. We'll go to, like, the DLC. VTuber, are you working? Are you. Are you. You seem to be. Nope. We, okay, so VTuber isn't fully capturing. That could just be my webcam. I mean, she's not glitching around, so that's good. Okay. Um. Yeah, I guess since we can't, uh, we can't have any money <laughs> or any bells, and I don't really have anything else to show you on the island, we will go do some DLC stuff. Hello, I'm one of Tom Nook's bell collectors, and I've been told that you haven't <laughs> paid your taxes. Oh no, Magic Master 118, welcome to the stream. Uh, at, okay, um, Tom Nook's uh, bell collectors. Oh, to Galaxy Air. Uh, don't tell Tom Nook that I am stealing his Wi Fi and streaming uh, behind his store. <laughs> I want to. No, I want to go to work. I'm going to go to work. 
pay up before I break those kneecaps. Are you the are you the person that put me in that in that um space pod thingy that was in my room? Is that skeleton? Did you are you the reason there's a skeleton in there? Dota one, this is Dota Tower. Wilbur, you copy? Blah blah blah. Got Walker and his wing. We're gonna. Oh, it was you. So the so the mystery has been solved, guys. The story is <laughs> the story is I didn't pay my um taxes to Tom Nook, so they sent Magic Master One One Eight to break my kneecaps and put me in that magic pod where I have turned into a skeleton. And then in the sleeping pod, I awoke as a clone and now here I am. <laughs> and I still haven't paid my taxes. <laughs> that is the story. <laughs> Hello, stranger. Was I doing something? If you're here to work, go check in with Lottie first. Oh, okay. Sometimes he talks to you if you like saved and quit. Oh, I know too much. Uh-oh. We might have another skeleton on my island, guys. Okay, so we're gonna, um, we're gonna do, we're gonna make someone's house here. I guess these are the people we have to choose from. So if you don't know, this is the DLC. You can buy it, but if you have the Nintendo Switch Online subscription, or the, what's it called? Nintendo Switch Extend, Extended? Nintendo Switch Plus? I don't remember what it's called. The one where you get the N64 stuff with it, Nintendo 64 emulator with it. You can actually um, get this DLC for free if you have that subscription, so that's good. This is why we intercept the mail to make sure you don't ask for ha ask for help for anyone. Oh no! <laughs> I mean, when I first moved into my island, I don't remember if it was Timmy or Tommy, but one of them called um, Tom Nook. What do they call him? Supreme ruler, or supreme leader, or something. <laughs> it was funny. <laughs> oh no! This is why we call him that. Is this is where Lottie is. I actually haven't been here in a while. Yes, I have gone into the right house. Eternal Sim. And I do know eventually you can like upgrade this island too. This DLC island and like decorate a store and uh, like a, a hospital and stuff. Uh, but I'm not that far yet. I don't know when that happens. Good morning, Eternal Sim. Hi, Lottie. I wish I could buy some of this stuff, but Rock Tree banned me having money. <laughs> so now I have no money. Can I, can I work? What's up? Are you looking for some work, Eternal Sim? I am. I'm a professional, as uh, you can see through the art below my VTuber that Chef Locky Cocky made for me. I am a professional, and that is my actual outfit for working, so you shall see. There we go. Here I am. <laughs> Good luck out there. Okay, thank you. I'm gonna go design a house. Hello, I forgot your name. What's your name? Hello? Wardle. Morning. I did good. I'm a good voice actor, guys. <laughs> Okay, let's pick somebody to design the house. Being banned for money is a serious situation. Yeah, it really is a problem. <laughs> I need a place to work out the to the rhythm of the music. So every um, villager has like a theme they want you to do, uh, decorate their house as. I want to hang out in a fancy place surrounded by riches. Oh, well, we can't do that one. Why did Automod get you? Because you... Automod got you because you wrote, you fake. Lose the glasses! How am I supposed to decorate? Okay, I'll lose the glass. And tell a story? Ooh, you know what, Blue Eyes by Boomer? You're actually showing me that that's not actually centered. So let me do that real quick. You guys can't see it, but let me, let me. I'll redeem something. I'll, I'll redeem. Tell a story, because I, I gotta do that anyway. There we go. Okay. That is why this is a test stream. What did Magic Master say? Also, by the way, fun fact, Tom Nook gives you fake stuff. Wait, Tom Nook gives you fake stuff. Those axes and other equipment is made out of rubber so you can't fight back. Watch, just try to use the axe on someone. Oh no. Actually, actually, I don't know. Can I use my tool on this island? No, it doesn't let me. I'll have to try that after we decorate. Oh yeah, you're right. I actually have to, I have to tell a bad joke. Tell a story. Okay, I'm taking my glasses off. Let's see if you guys can hear it. I shut them. I put them on my desk. They're off. Uh, because I don't have an actual camera, you guys have to take my word for it. If you guys don't know, I really can't see without my glasses. Everything is so blurry. I cannot see chat unless I go real close. There's a, a star is born. Thank you, Magic Master, for joining our galaxy. 
I appreciate it. I appreciate that, and I see you. Um, what was I doing? <laughs> I have so many things going on. I lost the glasses. I have to tell a story and a bad joke. Okay. So, let's do the bad joke first. I read. Uh, okay, so again, if you guys don't know, I read dad jokes off of a website. That is my bad joke. I, I'm not creative, creative enough to come up with my own. Um, so why is no one friends with Dracula? That's the joke. Feel free to guess. Why is no one friends with Dracula? And I have to tell a story. Let me think of one. Like a real story. You know what's funny? I actually was thinking. I had I had a story I wanted to tell you guys. And I was like, I'll just wait for someone to redeem it. And now that someone's redeemed, tell a story. I don't, I don't remember what it was. Yeah, it's gone out of my brain. Uh, once upon a time... Uh, I'll just tell you something that happened to me recently. <laughs> Wait, I gotta close this screen. Hey, too stinky? Who's stinky? He has cold blood? Oh, you guys are guessing? Okay, so why is no one friends with Dracula? My guess... Wait, I gotta go... I gotta go so close to the screen. <laughs> I can't see. My guess for Dracula would be he sucked all his blood brothers dry. Uh, it's not that deep. It's a <laughs> blind swipe over. It's a dad joke. <laughs> Why is no one friends with Dracula? Story. Once upon a time, this actually happened to me a few days ago. Um, Charles Symmetry was sitting in her uh, living room playing this game, actually. I was playing this game, trying to catch up on stuff because it, it had been a while. And I want to get the story moving along. Um, and I heard a really loud buzzing sound. And I mean a really loud buzzing sound. And the cats were like looking over in the corner all interested in the really loud buzzing sound. And so I walked over and I was like, uh, I'm, I'm really scared of bugs, by the way. And this was a bug. Um, it, it was, and so like I moved some stuff and turns out it was a really giant bumblebee. Huge, huge. Bumblebees are big, guys. Bumblebees are huge. I just hit my headset. I hope you guys didn't hear that, but I apologize if you did. Um, when I talk, I, I move my hands a lot. So that is what's happening. Um, giant bumblebee. Turn on she's afraid of bugs. Cats are going crazy because they want to catch this bumblebee. Bumblebees are very gentle. They don't usually sting um, unless provoked. And this one was provoked. It was angry. It was like, cats are attacking me. I, I'm scared. I want to get out of this house. I don't know how I'm here. I actually don't know how I got in the house. I'm not, through the door or something. I'm not sure. Um, so I like, I ran and I grabbed a, um, a glass cup and a, and a, and a, um, piece of paper to try to catch it with. But I was so scared. <laughs> because, again, it's angry. I'm afraid of bugs. But I know bumblebees are, like, endangered, right? They, uh, so, um. I don't like killing stuff anyway, but especially bumblebees because they're endangered, uh, from what I know. And they're really gentle creatures. They just happen to be in the house. And so I, uh, I caught it, okay, and I, and I put it outside, but I was so scared. And <laughs> when I put it outside, and I will get to the Dracula joke and catch up on chat soon. Um, I just don't want to get distracted because I, I, I will forget my story. Um, I put it outside, okay, and so, like, I, <laughs> I set the cup down. Hydrate. Okay, I will hydrate. I set the cup down and with the paper and I like I pulled up the cup and I like backed off really fast because it was angry and it was fly and it started flying around. It was buzzing around and it it was like I don't know if it was trying to attack me, but in my brain it was like a dragon that was trying to attack me. <laughs> I was like flailing and I ran back in the house. And like when as soon as I got in the house, I um I heard another buzzing noise or what I thought was a buzzing noise but I think it was just now now that I'm thinking about it I think it was just the paper that I had in my hand was crinkling a little bit but I thought it was the bee I thought it was like on my back ready to strike at any moment <laughs> and I dropped the glass cup and glass went everywhere and it broke and I was sad and then I had to clean it up the end try to start <laughs> okay let me catch up on chat, and then I will tell you why is no one friends with Dracula, guys? I will tell you that. Why is no one friends with Dracula? And then I'll hydrate. Um, okay, so. He's too stinky, is is one guess. He has cold blood. Who has what rumor is? My guess for Dracula would be he sucked all his blood brothers dry. Uh, because he blobs on. 
<laughs> or blabs on. And Blue Eyes My Boomer says, yeah, bumblebees don't really attack you unless absolutely wait i can't even i have no i can't read all my glasses on. unless of the absolutely need to wops and hornets however will attack you yeah those ones are mean those ones will actually attack you for no reason uh when i play video games i jump up and down sometimes <laughs> yeah i when i talk there's a pokemon chat guys it's a giraffe ring that's the one the pokemon i think i actually say right um so yeah i flail my arms a lot when i talk uh, okay, so what was I doing? Why is no one friends with Dracula, guys? I'm, I'm about to read the answer. The answer... Oh my gosh. <laughs> the answer is... He's a pain in the neck. No one is friends with Dracula because he's a pain in the neck. <laughs> if you guys are interested in the Pokemon game that is on my screen, it is free. It doesn't cost bits or anything. If you don't have a starter yet, just type in my chat, exclamation point, Pokestar, and you'll get a random starter. Um... If you do have a starter, type in estimation point Poke Catch and you'll get a random chance to catch the Pokemon. More than one person can catch it or no one can catch it. Um, the joke is that it's rigged, so that's why the rigged emote shows up every time the Pokemon gets away. Because sometimes, I've had streams where no one has caught the Pokemon. And I've had streams where multiple people has ca have caught the same Pokemon. So, it is all random. I don't control it. If you want more information on it, uh, estimation point Poke Help will send you um, a link to more information or whatever. Okay, let me hydrate. I will shake the water just because, again, I'm a YouTuber and I don't have a camera. So, just so you guys know that I have a drink here and I am actually doing what you're redeeming. Um, so, let me take that drink real quick. Automated alligator, I see you. Thank you so much for the bit donation and the cheer. I appreciate it. I have a little goal going on. Um, I'm not going to advertise it too much, but it is there, and I appreciate it, and I see you. Um, I don't have... Well, I see you. I don't have glasses on, but I kind of see you right now, <laughs> technically. I have no idea what my starter is. Uh, did you type an exclamation point poke start? Oh, you did. You already have a pass. Okay, so Magic Master... Uh, Go to my, I believe if you go to my about section, there should be like a little box there, a little um, screen where you should be able to see what Pokemon you have. There's no, unfortunately there's no way I could show it on my actual streaming screen. Uh, I'm going to put my glasses back on. I hope that's okay. <laughs> glasses, I can see. That's a plot twist. Streamers can see their chatters in real time. <laughs> They're right behind you. <laughs> Alright, guys. Uh, I said I was going to go working and that didn't work. I'll melt if I'm not surrounded by snow and ice. Well, then why are you on the beach? Look at this guy. He's sweating to death. I want an exclusive club that only plays my playlist. Okay, so guys. Should we design his house? I don't know any of their names. Should we design a club? Snow and ice. Riches. Or rhythm. I can actually smell users in chat. They don't stink. I just have a good... Oh, no. Oh, smell a vision Where was that from? I don't remember where that was from. <laughs> but, yeah. Thank you so much, Anime and Alligator. Welcome to the stream. I appreciate you. Did we get you a shout-out? Did we, okay, so who hasn't gotten a shout out? If you're a streamer and you want to be shouted out, let me know. My mods or I will do it. Uh, let me shout you out, automated alligator. Automated alligator. And if you guys don't know any of the streamers uh, that have been shouted out, feel free to check out check out their channels uh, through the links that show up. I know automated alligator does a lot of. Um, I believe speed running and shiny catching. Please correct me if I'm wrong. Automated alligator. Please correct me if I'm wrong. <laughs> Boo says no because I already shouted him out and Streamlabs needs a minute to like catch up. Smell efficient sounds like a Nickelodeon thing, but I've definitely heard of it before. I was thinking Nickelodeon too. I was, and I get like a like a a vision of a nose. It, it must be like an old Nickelodeon thing. 
Guys, I'm just getting... Thank you. Yeah, no problem, I'm gonna get alligator. No problem. Thank you for being here. I think I'm gonna do... Jimmy Neutron. He Tetra has a really good memory, by the way. She remembers everything from my childhood, and I remember nothing. <laughs> Alright, I think I'm gonna do Snow and Ice. Snow and Ice? Or, ooh, a club would... Snow and Ice. Snow and Ice or club, guys. What's your favorite genre of video games? Who are you asking, Magic Master? Or just everyone? Or me? If you can smell users and in chat, it's no wonder why you barely play Smash. Oh no. <laughs> God bless. <laughs> I remember that. Everyone. Okay, so for me, um, I play a lot of um, crafting, survival, uh, farming kind of games. I also play a lot of Nintendo games. Like Animal Crossing. Mostly chill games. A lot of like just relaxing chill games. I think I'm gonna do I think I'm gonna do Snow and Ice. So I'm here for some private time so no pictures or autographs, right? Hey, wait up. You're one of those folks who design vacay homes, aren't you? I've realized I need a vacay home for my happiness and that of everyone around me <laughs> for my happiness and that of everyone else. No. Can you help me out? Uh, yes. And her name is Sprinkle. That's really cute. You mean it? That's so awesome. Let's get to building a vacation palace. So we're gonna we're gonna design her home. Let's get this party started. For my dream vacation palace, I'm thinking of something like Castle of Cold. Okay, so those are the items I have to use. So I can pretty much design it any way I want. I could even just put those items down. They have to be in that house, though. Oh, that's very nice. I really like your concept. All right, now the next step is for you to choose an island for the client. Okay, so I'm gonna... Obviously, we're gonna pick a cold place. So these are the places we could pick from. Again, guys, this is a DLC for Animal Crossing New Horizons. There is a 3DS game very similar to this. If you guys have a 3DS and you're interested in it, it's called Happy Home Designer. This one's really icy, so let's pick this one. Amazing! Perfecto! I can't wait to see it. Now sprinkle. We found an excellent location for you, but you'll need to see it for yourself before we begin. Eternal Sim, please leave Sprinkle to the site, and best of luck. Okay. So we're gonna go design her house. But yeah, I play uh, Magic Master. I play a little bit of everything. Um, pretty much everything. I don't play a lot of scary, spooky games, but um, there is a few that I that I do like to play, like Phasmophobia. Um, and I have Granny. I haven't streamed it yet, but I'm, I'm waiting for like spooky season to do that stuff. So. Oh my gosh, this is the perfect spot. My vacay home will be right here. I'm super excited. Okay. <laughs> All right, Eternal Sim, I'm going to leave you to it. Now, let's see if I even remember how to do this. Um. How do. Uh, uh, I already forgot. Is this right? Is this the button? Okay, so I can move the house, which I probably will. I kind of. Ooh. What's happening? Alright, I froze a little bit there. I don't know if you guys did. Again, guys, this is. A <laughs> This, I should probably go back to this. This is a test stream. My PC was broken for like two weeks, so things can possibly go wrong. Uh, I don't want to jinx anything. Ooh, you could change the time of day. You could change the weather, which I'm assuming might it might snow. I kind of want it to be night because it kind of looks cooler. Snow? Where's the snow? Maybe if I leave. It lied to me. <laughs> <laughs> it isn't snowing. Uh, let me try to catch up on chat. Uh, everyone's uh, listing their favorite games. Automatic Alligator says, I like fighters, action, adventure, and RPGs. Blue Eyes Boomer says, strategy and or party. Matching Master says, I like survival and horror, which is weird since I barely can make it through the intro of a horror game. <laughs> <laughs> um, I also play... I haven't streamed in a long, long time, but Seven Days to Die is another game I like that's survival horror, kinda. Um, Key Tetra says too many to pick from. Uh, 
Alien Isolation, I've heard of that one. I've never played it, but that one's that. That one is very spooky. Uh, I watched um, some YouTubers play it back in the day. It's pretty, uh, well, probably Alien Isolation haven't, uh, get scared pretty easily. I can't read, guys. It's really good. What's your favorite strategy game, Blue? Simulators are cool, too. Simulators! Guys, there's a simulator game I want to play. Um, a walking simulator game. Uh, called Stanley Par Parable? Do not have it yet. But they recently came out with one called Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe. Uh, look forward to that in the future, because I'm going to be streaming that uh, once I can pick it up. It is a funny game, so... It's very self-aware and funny. Uh, Pokemon is strategy. Pokemon's like a RPG uh, strategy game. Mario Party 3 and Mario Party Superstars. Those are good games. Alright, Sprinkle. You are very cute. Look, this is Sprinkle. She is cute. <laughs> now, um, stand, I guess, stand where you were standing. <laughs> it's fine. Um... Oh, Don't Starve is a good one, too, and Astroneer. Those are both really good games, Magic Master. Okay. I actually don't think I've ever streamed Don't Starve. I'm really bad at that game. Alright, so we're going to design Sprinkles outside of her house, and then we're going to design the inside. Sprinkle wants... So I can't have any flowers. That doesn't make sense, but trees do make sense. Never mind. Never mind, you can't you can't plant trees on ice. Um you can't plant trees on a glacier apparently. <laughs> no, it makes sense. No. Wait. Uh erase all of that from your memory. And <laughs> it, it didn't happen. <laughs> you just got Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe. I am excited to try that. Winter recommended, yeah, that makes sense. Um Have you tried it, Magic Master? Have you tried it yet? And what do you think of it if you have? Uh, never mind. We can't put any trees in this place. I don't know what I'm doing. Where, where's my buttons? So, what decorations can we have out here? I guess we can have any of this. Which makes sense, again. <laughs> don't listen to me. <laughs> don't listen. I don't know what I'm saying half the time. Uh, a, a chair. There we go. <laughs> she gets one chair in her yard and that's it. So, you can unlock more stuff um, for this DLC. I just haven't unlocked pretty much anything. Ooh, a snowman. Hey, look, now I'm just going to put some stuff. Okay, cool, cool. Well, since I can't really... I can't give her a real tree, let's give her... Let's give her a fake ice tree. <laughs> it has jokes about the Xbox, Xbox port. Which is funny since you play it on Xbox. Yeah, what I really like about Stanley Parable is that it's so, uh... uh self-aware. It's so self-aware, and I love it. And it's funny. It has really funny humor. So how do I... Copy, hold, ZR? Ooh, I did it. I did a thing. We're giving her some fake trees because we can't give her <laughs> real trees. Ooh. Oh. What's the difference? Wait. Oh, okay. So it's just darker. Does dark blue look good, mm -hmm. guys? Played like seven endings. It's good. You can pass by hours and not notice. And when you complete one ending, for me at least, you really want to do another? Yeah. I know there's so many endings. Cause so if you guys don't know what Stanley Parable, you can pick which path you go on. Uh, and it, it just has so many endings. I didn't mean to delete it! No! I just wanted to change it. <gasps> Look at the different snowmen! Oh, I love it. Well, let's... I, I want all of them. Okay, so this one's gonna stay blue. This one's gonna be this one. This one's gonna be this one. And this one. Oh, no! <laughs> Wait, I push. Guys, I always push the wrong button. And this one's gonna be this one. Okay. 
Well, at least we could put snowmen and stuff in her yard. The narrator gets mad at you when you don't do what he says, which is funny. Yeah, I do remember that. So I did play Stanley Parable a long time ago before I was even a streamer. And uh, I do remember <laughs> I do remember the narrator getting upset with you if you don't uh, follow what he wants you to do. As I'm not going to try too hard on this yard. I probably should. Can I change the color to this? I can. Ooh, let's do rainbow. It doesn't look that different. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> it's fine. What a beautiful house. Wait, should I put this here? Or a yard. This isn't. There's a Pokemon in chat, guys. A Lit Leo. There's a Lit Leo in chat. Whatever, this is good. <laughs> it also has meta jokes about how it should go back to the original Stanley Parable. It has references to it. That's awesome. Yeah, I'm super excited to try that game. I'm super excited. I don't know exactly what's different. Um, I do know they added some stuff. Because the original one is pretty old now. No, I didn't want... Uh, we're getting rid of this chair. Goodbye, chair. Because they have snowmen and snowflakes. That is the yard. <laughs> this is a good yard, right, guys? <laughs> Sprinkle <will> like it. <laughs> Move this over. But yeah, guys, Animal Crossing New Horizons is such a relaxing game. Can I put, like, path or anything down? I don't know how to do that. I don't even know if I can do that yet. Uh, I don't see a, I don't see a way to do that. So, never mind. There you go, Sprinkle. There's your house. Enjoy. <laughs> it's good. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. Uh, the serious room in the OG game is funny. I don't remember. I, I remember on the closet one where you like went into the closet. Ooh, congratulations on catching the lit Leo, Magic Master. Okay, so this she wants a tree in her she wants all this in her house. How am I gonna? <laughs> How am I supposed to design this? Sprinkle, what is wrong with you? Wait a second, can I make her house- Wait, can I- Is there a way for me to make the house any bigger? Because if I keep it that small- That's not the button I want. I think there is a way. I might have to move these though. So let's move these. Let's put them here for now. Uh, because if I keep them that small and those big sculptures are in it. Well, this isn't making the house bigger. I, I know my thing is kind of covering up. Or my uh, goal. My goals. My streaming goals are covering up what I'm doing. Uh, what you guys see is what I'm seeing. So it's covering it up for me too. <laughs> oh, Sprinkle is kind of this color. But this isn't making the house any bigger. Well, I guess. I guess I can't make it bigger. Well, at least I changed the color. That looks good. <laughs> I don't know how I'm going to design this house. How much giant sculptures in it? Well, I guess I, I decided I'm going to put these over here. They look kind of good here. I, I apologize if you guys hear motorcycles going by. It is that time of year. Okay. Well, that's fine. We're just gonna do that. <gasps> wait, wait a second. Fences? Oh. Well, I don't want to put any fences, but now I know I can. Wait a second. Frozen fence? <gasps> it lights up? Okay, now I want to put fences. Wait. Wait, this looks dumb. <laughs> wait. Oh, wait. <laughs> Never mind. It kind of looks good. I don't know what I'm doing. Sprinkle, you're in my way. Wait a second. Sprinkle, no, move! No, 
Break off. Go away. <laughs> if you tried hacking, you would get to the serious room for a hundred million years to think about what you've done. <laughs> Also, they throw jabs at reviews of the Stanley Parable in the new game, which is funny. I am super excited to try that out, and I see you hi um, redeeming Hydrate. I appreciate that as well. Uh, again, I do have water here. Okay. Um, I wasn't going to put a fence, but then I did. The end. <laughs> <laughs> is that is that right? I think that's right. I think that's even. Um, so as you can see, my designs are really bad. Wait, how do I get rid of fence? Oh, why? Uh, partly, I want to blame it on um not having a lot unlocked, but maybe I'm just bad at designing and I'm in denial. <laughs> This is a good house, right guys? Or a good yard? Wait a second. Something's wrong. Oh, it's not even. Oh no, my tree is. No, no, wait. My tree is too far over. And the time would extend if you tried hacking again. What do you mean by hacking? I didn't know you could hack. A second. Yeah. Ah. Beautiful. And this is her yard. <laughs> Doesn't make a lot of sense, but it's fine. Now, how do I get out of this menu? Here we go. All right, I gotta get to sleep. Uh. I gotta go to sleep later. Bye. Well, thank you so much for joining the stream and for following Magic Master. I appreciate you. And thank you for sparing my kneecaps. I appreciate that as well. <laughs> but yeah, this, this guys, this stream isn't going to be much longer. I'm just going to design this house and that's it. Uh, just because it is a test stream. Uh, and I'm hungry. The end. <laughs> How am I going to... This is what she wants me to design with. This. I just, I, I'm, I'm looking at it and I'm like, how am I supposed to make this into it? it how am I supposed to make this into a, a, a house that's worth living in? I want to test those smoothies. Ooh, smoothies. I want to test smoothies too. I don't know what flavor they are. It probably, it might say it. I don't know. No, Animal Crossing has their own like language, so we can only guess what flavor they are. Melon, mango, and fruit punch. I don't know. I, uh, VTuber, are you are you not capturing my mouth movement very well? Sometimes you are. Put my face under those nozzles. <laughs> okay. I don't know. I don't know how I'm gonna design this. It's gonna be a mess. That's okay. Uh, one of the cool things about uh, this DLC too is ooh, wait. Is that you can go back and redesign. <gasps> Ooh, this one actually shows it snowing outside. I like that. We're going to use that one. Is you can go back and redesign. So if I make a house and it's horrible because I don't have a lot of stuff on that. I can go back and uh, make it look better later. Wow. This is cool. It doesn't make a lot of sense, but it is cool. What do we got for rugs? Ice rug? Frozen four? Oh, okay. Oh. <laughs> Never mind. I wasn't I wasn't in the right menu, that's part of the reason why I did that. I'm supposed to be in this menu to design stuff with. Or this whatever it's called. Wow, she's gonna have like the weirdest She's literally gonna have two sculptures in her house and a slushy machine. <laughs> Or three sculptures and a slushy machine. What is this house? I just want to make it look... <laughs> this is going to be 
be the whole house? Well, let's see what... I mean, we can change the colors. I guess I don't have it unlocked where, um... Let's see if blue looks better. Eh. I guess I don't have it unlocked yet. What is happening? Help. Uh, where I can make the houses bigger? I thought you could do that, but I guess... Maybe that's something I get later. I guess... Okay, let's just keep that regular ice. Here's the smoothies that we have here for some reason. Oh, she has smoothies. Okay, wait. I'm thinking thoughts. My brain is working. Um, let's make it like an ice cream place. So let's see if we can have like some tables. Ooh, a counter. Oh, maybe they like sell the smoothies. Okay. I mean, she wanted a palace, but this is fine too. Okay, could she fit back there? Sell me some smoothies. <laughs> Okay, okay. And then... I know this is an ice table, but it looks a little too big. Yeah, for this small little house. I mean, maybe I'll put one. Oh, here's the ice cream display. Eh. Hmm. <laughs> this is such a small little house. Okay, maybe you can help yourself to smoothies. Oh man, I don't... <sighs> Frickle, what are you doing to me? I guess it's okay. Maybe you can help yourself to ice cream too. No, why would you let customers help? That would be a disaster. But maybe Sprinkle doesn't care. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna keep this back here. We're gonna put this over here. We're gonna have a table, at least one table. Uh, and then we have frozen. Frozen. I cannot speak, guys. Frozen treat set. And then. I saw ice cream cones. Where are they? I'm not going crazy, right? Thought I, oh, here they are. What? Oh. Delicious. <laughs> Just on the floor. <laughs> Alright. Alright, let's get a table. Table? I don't know if I can use the ice table. It's just so big for this small house. Can I change this to look kind of like mm -hmm. an ice? An ice. I mean white, right? What's that going to look like? Oh, that's not too bad. That's fine. <laughs> I don't give me any space to work with. Wait a second. Are we gonna have one one table in this ice cream place? Or maybe we're gonna have I don't like that then. There's not symmetry. I needed that bear. Bear? Wait, I need that bear. Where's that bear? There we go. Well, I guess we're gonna have one table. I'm not gonna complicate it too much. This ice cream place has one table and one popsicle. <laughs> okay, well, I need a chair. So let's get a chair. This one? Uh, I guess. White? Don't lick anything in here should be a warning sign. You're not wrong, Amy. <laughs> that doesn't look right. Wait, can I? What about blue? Light blue? Someone's gonna try and do it. 
someone is gonna try and do it, and it's probably gonna be Sprinkle. I think that's her name. Well, I mean, I don't have a lot of room to work with, so it's not perfect. It's really not ideal. Maybe in the future we can go back and fix this place. I don't know if my character... I, I'm gonna walk my character through here. I don't think they're gonna fit. Huh, wait. Maybe I should just have one chair. <laughs> one table and one chair in this ice cream place. It's fine. Frozen chair, would that look better? That might look better. There's a Pokemon in chat. What is it? A Finian? A Finian? It's a fish. Nope. You won't be able to sit in this chair. It does look better, but you can't sit in it. Unless there's no table and it's just like a sit down. Ooh, wait. And then the table's in the corner, a small little thing. Like this. A side table. Or like this. We have blue, but let's try white first. Tablecloth? Okay. Wait, I saw blue. Where is it? There it is. Ah, uh, it doesn't look. <laughs> she likes it, though. I guess that's all that matters is that she likes it. It's fine. And then I'm going to put an ice cream or whatever was on Or frozen treats on it. I could change it. Ooh, delicious. Oh, look at that one. has like a lime in it or a lemon. Vanilla and chocolate soda flavor. Berry flavor. Kiwi fruit. Chocolate mint. Ooh. Chocolate mint, guys. Chocolate mint. <laughs> okay, yeah. I mean, I didn't have a lot of space to work with, but... Okay, and now let's do the walls. Um, okay. Do not know what can go on the walls. So let's see. Um, what's this? Shelf with bottles? Okay. Maybe not that. <laughs> Low in the dark stickers? What is this? Hands? <laughs> oh no. Ooh, I like- Ooh, snowflakes! I was gonna say- Dinosaurs! I was going to say I like this, but snowflakes make sense. Let's put one of these on every window. She really liked it. She had a heart. And I assume when I go in the dark, I'm going to test it. If it doesn't go in the dark and it lies to me, I'm going to be sad. <laughs> Alright, let's test it. Are these glowing? These don't look like they're glowing. Game. I mean, I, maybe it's because I picked snowflakes. Let me just, let me just test something. Do the stars glow? better. These aren't glowing. These are not glowing. Does this look like they're glowing? <laughs> These aren't glowing. Lies. It's fine. I'm going to keep them on the window anyway. Um, okay. Uh, now what? What else can we put on the wall? No, that's the ceiling. Uh, we will see what we can put on the ceiling, but first we look around. What's this? I can't see it. <laughs> this is a bigger ice. Okay, yeah. Or maybe it would look better if I like put them in between the windows. I don't know. Put something there. I always put um, 
So every time I remember, I try to put the uh, villagers picture and the uh, and the house I'm making for them. It's just something I like to do. So let's put or a poster. Let's put hers right there. And I guess we'll surround it with these ice or snowflake wreaths. And another lying glow in the dark sticker that doesn't glow. Okay, yeah. Should I put these here? No. Goes there. Alright. No, I always do that. The last thing I wanted to look at was uh, these. Because it is an ice cream shop. Uh, no, well, I wanted to change what it looked like. But it doesn't look like I can... Huh. I might have to... Pull these down. Um, okay. That there. Any that look good in an ice cream shop? I mean, it's, it, it, it looks fine. I'm gonna move it, though. And then, oh wait, uh, no, I didn't. You know, for not having a lot of room, I feel like I did pretty good. I do not know if they'll fit on this wall, but let's see. No. Alright. But yeah, as you can see guys, this uh, DLC is very relaxing. You literally just design. <laughs> Yeah, okay. Ice cream shop. Uh, and for the ceiling, I have a lot to choose from. What's this? What is that? Oh, maybe I can make it look like snow or an icicle. It's very hard to see it. Oh, she likes it. Okay, well... Oh, there we go. I just had to change the... I mean... It was very, <laughs> very hard to control. Uh, from that angle. I guess I'll put it, like, right here, maybe? There we go. I guess that's good. There's our ice cream shop. I like how everything glows a little bit, except for the stickers that say they're glow in the dark. They're not glowing. <laughs> I mean, it's fine. This is this is what it is. It's a little weird ice cream shop on a glacier. <laughs> That's what I came up with. Should I keep the light on? I probably should. It looks cooler and with it off, but it's fine. Okay. Um, and I won't be able to talk to her if she's there, so let's put her up there. Hello, Sprinkle, here's your house. It's an ice cream <laughs> shop, <laughs> and you have no bed. <laughs> Is everything ready? It's ready. Wow, I've been waiting on pins and needles. I, I've even been experiencing at least two other waiting cliches. Oh, okay. <laughs> hey, Eternal Sim, hold up a sec. Wait, what? Did I unlock something? Sorry, just need a moment for a quick supervisor to designer consult, if you don't mind. Oh, look at him. He's wearing earmuffs. I just realized. 
You're getting red. You're getting really good at this interior design thing. But I've got a cool technique to show you that can take it to the next level. Why did you not tell me this before I finished designing? <laughs> Remember how Wardle made the office furniture sparkle just by polishing it? Well, he showed me how to do it. With this neat trick, you can make a room's furniture shine. Get ready for Operation Sparkle. <laughs> Step one. Get your bod and your polishing duds ready with L. Step two. Face the furniture item and press A. Step three. Oh, wait. There's no step three. So that's it. If you find any furniture that could do an, with an extra sparkle, try it out. Okay. Well, let's try it on these bear statues. Wow, you'll do that too? Thanks. Okay, just let me know when you're done. Alright, well, let's see if I can figure this out. Polishing indoor items. A and Y. Oh, okay. Press A again to remove the effect. Or hold down A to do an especially thorough job. Okay. So hold down A. Wait, I'm sparkling the wrong thing. What did I sparkle? Oh, no, I wasn't sparkling the wrong thing. Oh yeah, and make it look... Oh wait. Hold down A. It's so shiny. Oh, I, I actually like that. Ooh, now you have a shiny store. Okay, I want to sparkle these, but I can't reach them. So we'll do it this way. I hope the sparkle doesn't go away when I move it again. So sparkly! Okay, and I think I can reach this one. Let's see. There! <laughs> no. Now she has a sparkly- ooh, that looks really nice without the light. Now she has a really sparkly place. Okay, yeah. I'm done. How do I stop being a sparkly lady? Is everything ready? It's ready, and I'm keeping the lights off even though I shouldn't. Sweet, I've been waiting for this. You spent all this time building this just for me? I'm so happy. Ah, you did amazing, Eternal Sim. Thanks. I am quite the designer. <laughs> you OBS don't you lose frames or drop frames castle of coal which I turned into an ice cream palace <laughs> or an ice cream uh, whatever ice cream shop I love the little montage they do. Yay! Yay is right, Ambunet. It's beautiful. It's so sparkly now. <laughs> you were such a huge help today. Say, before you go, could you take some snaps of my place? Yeah, I gotta, I'm gonna take a picture. Sweet, make it look good. Uh, let me know when you're done. Alright, so, uh, before you finish, you have to take a picture, but I don't remember my buttons to do that, so let me... Eh. Now how do I put you in chair? Yeah, there you go. I'll take a double scoop chocolate chip cookie dough cone and some mango smoothie. Two hundred dollars! That's quite the tip, Amunet. Two hundred dollars for a <laughs> for a double scoop chocolate chip cookie dough cone and a mango smoothie. <laughs> it better be like a um, premium quality. I don't know the real life to AC money ratio, but considering Nook, that sounds about right. You're right, Amunet. You're right. Don't tell, um, <laughs> don't tell. Who was it? Who was it? Wait. Oh, I forgot their name. It's so dumb. Magic Master. Don't tell Magic Master. They apparently work for, uh, Tom Nook. <laughs> Kitty Tetra. It's so hot. I die. No, Kitty Tetra, don't die. Come to Sprinkles Ice Cream Shop where everything's shiny and I don't remember how to take a picture. Oh, it says right there. Camera. Uh, R. Oh, wait. That wasn't the right camera. <laughs> that was my camera. <laughs> wait, that was, wait. Oh, it says it right here. No. There we go. Uh, get rid of my person. Goodbye. 
Uh, okay. So, I could change, like, the, uh... The, uh, filter. Ooh, that one looks good. Pop. Soft. Dramatic. That looks cool. Film. Monochrome. Antique. Normal. Sharp. I like to pop, I think, because it doesn't look so dark. Alright, so how do I angle this right and zoom in? You know, <laughs> you're just sitting in a thing. I don't remember if I can make them do anything, that's okay. I can make them look at me. How do I... wait, why? I had to look down at my thing. I want to get a good, like, angle. Is this good? It's Pokemon chat. <gasps> it's a swine up. Oh, I gotta try to catch it. It's so cute. Sprinkle, why'd you get out of the chair? Sprinkle move chairs. I was thinking too long. I forgot they do that. Estimation white Poke catch. Guys, if you want a chance to catch the swine up, uh, feel free. I don't know if I'll catch it, but... Now Sprinkle's taking selfies. <laughs> Sprinkle. Alright, um... No, wait, Sprinkle. Wait, I was supposed to take a picture. Eh. Aw. Close your eyes, but I think it's cute. Okay, did it work? Did it work? Oh yeah, it's there. It's being blocked by my thing, but it's good enough. Hey you, what's up? Oh wait, I'm heading back. Hey, leaving already? We'll come visit any time. Okay, bye. Welcome back. How did things go? I have to think you're pretty used to the work now, right? It's payday again. Oh, don't tell Rock Tree. <laughs> Here's 6,000 pokey just for you. They did ban bells though, right? Pokey's technically different. I want to thank you again for all the hard work you've been putting in. You're such a big help. That said, it's not good for anyone to work themselves too hard, so it's break time. Break time. Do enjoy a change of pace for as long as you like. I suggest taking a walk around the whole island. Maybe I'll go out for a stroll too. I can use the steps. Oh, speaking of exercise, there are vines on the cliffs nearby. Sturdy enough for anyone to climb on them? Okay. I got the swine up! Yay! You can really work up a sweat doing that. Try climbing them. Okay. Talk to you later. Alright, um, so Lottie wants me to look around the island, so I'll do that real quick, and then I'll, I'll probably end the stream soon. What is this? What is that? Hello? Silver confetti blower. Oh. No, thank you. That sounds fun, but no thank you. Do you have anything to say? Good talk. Glad we had it. So, walk around the island. Oh! Lottie. Oh, okay. I'm not going to talk to her because we'll do that in the next uh, next time I stream this. She's going to want... Well, maybe I won't talk to her. Okay, well, let me look around first. She's going to want me to design some stuff on the island like I mentioned earlier. So, eventually, I knew you could um, design stuff on the island. So, I guess I, I did enough houses or I designed enough houses for, for me to be able to do that. I tried to pick up the pillar, but it doesn't let me. <laughs> so that is in our future. I wasn't going to talk to her, but I think I will. Okay, we got a little ladder here. Oh, there's a person way over here? Oh, I didn't know they were way over here. I guess I could have picked more people to help. Oh no, these are the people I've already helped. Eternal Sim Darling. What is it that I could do for you? Oh, stop. Oh, she tooted. Well, that's embarrassing. Uh, how are things? Oh, you see the picture that I took. Since I've come to stay at this lovely oasis, my skin has been in such amazing condition. Perhaps it's, perhaps it's because all my stress has melted away. Okay. Um, what do you have to say? Hey, remember that vacation home you helped to make for me? You know that one, right? The one for me. I just wanted to tell you it's amazing and also that I got you this because you're amazing too. Oh, they give me stuff? Thanks. I bet you didn't expect a, a circus wall. Oh. 
Well, I didn't expect that. <laughs> and I didn't want it. <laughs> My vacation house is absolutely the best thing since funnel cake was invented. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, and this is for you, to thank you. Oh, I'm getting more, ooh, more gifts. Tree stump rug, oh, okay. Why didn't she give me something? Rude. I demand stuff, just kidding. Okay, well, let's talk to Lottie and then we'll go back to our really ugly island. <laughs> <laughs> that one. Uh, oh, Eternal Sim! You startled me. What's up? Well, I got lost without looking at this property. Have you noticed all the unused properties around here? Before I set up shop, someone else was working on developing the island. They built all of these. But for whatever reason, it didn't work out. And I guess they just left their properties like this. Lately, I've been thinking about how we could put these properties to use. Maybe some new facilities. If we had even more to offer our clients, I'm sure a vacation home business would boom. I just know we could breathe a lot of life into these old properties. Maybe we start with this one. I think it was originally going to be a school of some kind. Why not pick up where they left off? Who would go to school? You gotta travel all the way to an island to go to school? All I have to do is get a little paperwork in order and we could get to work. Okay, okay. Uh, pump the brakes, Lottie. Sorry, I just get so excited when I think about business development. We're going to need more clients to make uh, these facilities viable, so let's keep growing that client base. For now, head back to the office. Come and see me when you're ready to get to work. So I think she's saying I can I can design the school? Going to school, I'm not that, <laughs> I'm not that young. Uh, so I guess we can design a school now, but I'm not going to do that yet. We're going to go back to our ugly island. Oh, really cute pig! Lucy, if I had a vacation home nearby, I could stop by here whenever I feel like it. Snoink. <laughs> I don't always read their catchphrases, but sometimes they're funny. Okay, yeah, this is really cool. This DLC is really cool. I said I look around a little bit. I, hello. This is such a feel like I could hang out here forever. Yes, if I were doing this right, I really would need a vacation home or two, wouldn't I? Why would you need two? I should go look at the resort souvenirs. It's been a while since I bought a thing to throw away later. Oh no, it's too real. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> that was fun. I love regular Jacques back home on the mainland. You're dealing with fan fancy Jacques right now. Okay, I believe that's how you pronounce his name. Okay, well, whatever. We're leaving. Hello. Socket wrench is standing by. What's your flight plan? Compost bin? Did Wilbur just call me a compost bin? I am so offended right now. <laughs> you want to go back to Galaxy? Is that right? I guess so. Socket wrench. Roger that. Let's fly. Wow. I am so offended. <laughs> Call me a compost bin. Why did why did I deserve that? I didn't deserve that. Get out of here, Wilbur. I don't like you anymore. We're not friends. Hello, General Ginyu. Welcome to the stream. Or this test stream. Compost bin. Yeah, Wilbur just called me a compost bin. Okay, so for anyone joining, I'll just quickly show the island a little bit. It, it really needs help. Who's singing? Zell's singing. Oh, never mind. <laughs> never mind, Zell's not singing anymore. Oh, never mind, he is singing. What a beautiful voice. I don't know what song he's singing. Um. Oh, we didn't buy any rugs. Let's get some rugs. Uh, so this island is fairly new and it's a mess. Nothing is organized. My villagers live on the beach. <laughs> uh, Sahara's gonna sell me some rugs, but I'm only gonna get the mysterious flooring and wallpaper. I don't have any bells! Never mind, I'm not- wait. What does she say when you have no bells? <laughs> I never speak the awkwards. Your bells are not enough in quantity. It's 3,000 bells I need for such mystery. Perhaps we talk again in the future, yes. I forgot rock tree banned my bells and I have to dig them up out of the, <laughs> out of the ground. There we go. 
There's an easier way to do that, but for some reason I did it that way. Here's my bells. <laughs> now I have money. Okay, now we can buy the flooring and wallpaper. She always gives me ugly ones. She? I don't know. I don't know Sahara's or Sahara's gender. So again, did you require rugs for your naked floors? <laughs> yes. Okay, give, give. Oh, Zell's singing again. If you put it like okay, if you put a song on a radio, and I believe if you put it outside, a KK Slider song, they will sing that instead. I don't know what he's singing. Hi, Apple. <laughs> Apple's just sitting in the corner. Okay, yes, give. A serious flooring, please. Thank you. Go away. Nope, go away. <laughs> Not interested. <laughs> Okay. Also, what is this? It's a fossil. Uh, we didn't time travel today. It's not the right time in game. Because I did time travel before. Uh, these are all my little cute babies. <laughs> I love them. I love the designs that they did. Uh, so they look a lot different in the older games. This is my house. Oh, oh! I can polish stuff in my own house now. This is my beautiful house. I really like this flooring and wallpaper. I did show this earlier. I'm just gonna quickly show it uh, now because I'm gonna end the stream very soon. This is my questionable uh, back room. Uh, there is a story to it. Uh, not sure exactly what the story is, but uh, we do have some theories. <laughs> Let's see what uh, Sahara gave me. Is it, wait, is this? Oh, okay. Let's see what we. Okay, so first, let's see what we got from the actual island. A uh, circus wall, beautiful. A uh, tree stump rug. Oh, that's an actual rug. Oh, okay. I thought it was a flooring. Can I put it now? It's literally what it says it is. <laughs> okay. I guess this is what we got from Sahara. Flooring and an ivy wall. I actually do like the ivy wall. That is an older item that's in the older game, so I do like that. I do not like this flooring. No, that's the rug. Wait, put this back. Sorry, Sky's rug. Push all the rug vines. Where'd I have this? I had it like right here, right? No, I don't remember. It's fine. Uh, no, this one. This one wall. Oh, oh, well, apparently that's over there now. <laughs> Wait. Uh, it's fine. Oh, well. <laughs> push the wrong buttons every time I play any video game. Alright, I'll show you guys the island real quick and then I'll end the stream. We'll raid out. But yeah, guys, this was a test stream and I, I appreciate you guys, um, everyone who uh, hung out with me today and, and uh, whatnot. So my island's a mess. There's no, uh, there's no, <laughs> there's no theme to it. I'm just putting random items everywhere. Um, apparently, Isabel wants me to have some more trees and flowers and stuff. Uh, because we're trying to get our island ranking up to three stars. So, out of five stars, we have to get it up to three stars so KK Slider can visit. Wait, Zell's? Oh, yeah, Zell's still singing. <laughs> In Camel Frog's ear, apparently. Um, so, KK Slider can visit and we can move on with the... Um, with the game and unlock terraforming and be able to actually organize the island. 
Uh, I'm not gonna like jump the rivers and stuff because I didn't decorate anything over there. There's some there's some houses and stuff over there, but there isn't really any decorations. But yeah, this is my little messy island. Um, I will explain. <laughs> I'll explain the streaming setup behind Nook's shop over here or Nook's cranny. Uh, so I steal his Wi-Fi and I uh, I use it to stream. He hasn't noticed yet. My my character has a really really sweet streaming setup. Wait, I'm trying to get it so that you can see the chair too. There we go. Really sweet streaming setup. When I sit in the chair, it lights up. It's hard to tell because it's day, but if it was night, you'd be able to see it. The chair lights up. I'm a little jealous um, of their setup. <laughs> but yeah, the story is I steal um, Nook's Wi-Fi and I stream from it. <laughs> he hasn't noticed yet. <laughs> but anyway. But yeah, that's my uh, little island. Is there anything else I wanted to show you? There's a Pokemon in chat before we go. A Surviper. Ooh, that's a cool Pokemon. I like that one. Um, but yeah, I appreciate you guys for, um, being here. Where am I going to stand so we can, we can have a little outro? Um, let's go stand, let's go stand over here. This is one of my favorite parts of the island. I might not really change it that much. I set up like a little, like a little, um, place where you can eat. <laughs> and make food <laughs> but anyway guys thank you so much for for joining me on this test stream if you guys don't know my pc did break that's my point okay catch i'm gonna try to catch the survivor uh my pc did break and so i didn't stream for a few weeks and i really wanted to and i did try but it didn't work so i did a test stream today to see if everything is uh working i had to set everything back up manually because we did a factory reset not a factory reset a recovery reset or whatever they call it um, not tech savvy, don't know what to call it. Um, but yeah, so I had to manually set everything up. Uh, some things might change on my menus and stuff, uh, but I did throw it all together. It took me a while to do, because I, I tried to remember everything. I had to remember <laughs> everything I had set up. Things seem to be working. Things seem to have gone well. Um, I Again, I appreciate you guys for showing up. I appreciate you. Uh, I appreciate the follower. Um, again, I'm really bad at names. Magic Master th 118, thank you so much for uh, following. Automated Alligator, Blue Eyes Boomer, um, Rock Tree, Amunet Kitty Catcher, Chef, everyone who showed up. I apologize if I missed someone, but yeah. Let me see if we can get someone to raid real quick. Uh, uh, let's see, who is streaming? Tabs so that we don't get any random streams. Uh, let's see who we got going. If you guys have any suggestions for someone we can raid out to, let me know. Uh, try not to take too much time to pick and choose. I do like, uh, if you guys don't know, I do like uh, raiding people um, who are trying to hit affiliate or don't have a lot of viewers. Show them some support and whatnot. All right. Um, let's see. Animal Crossing. Horizons. Animal Crossing New Horizons. You're super welcome. Well, thank you so much, Amina. I appreciate that. Um, all right. Let's see if I can find someone to raid out to. Partner push. Wow. Partner push, guys. Recommended? No. Sort by viewers low to high. There we go. Uh, more power to them. Partner push. Wow. Uh, no, 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 no. I, I do see... Um, should we raid someone who's playing Animal Crossing? I'm gonna click this person's stream. Uh, you might hear them. Why don't I hear anything? Uh oh, they might not have their their thing working. Well, you know what? 
I have an idea. Unless someone has a suggestion, let me see. No one has a suggestion. Okay, I have an idea, guys. Let's raid someone called the Slimeologist. I've never raided them before. Um, pretty big streamer compared to what I usually raid. But um, they make a lot of really cute art. It's, it looks like they're going to be playing. It says starting soon. I'm, I'm looking at their, their stream right now. It says starting soon. Looks like they're going to be playing a game called Bug Snacks or Bug Snacks. I don't know that game, but um, let's go raid them. Get the present? Okay, Amunet has requested get the present, so let's get the present real quick. <laughs> where is it? I do hear it. Oh no, where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Okay, let's get the present for Amunet. Let's shoot this present out of the sky and then we'll raid the Slimeologist. Let's see what's in this present. A bun wig? Okay, we gotta wear it. There we go. Oh, we're cute! Look at us! That was worth it. Oh, and my little bear backpack. My character's pretty cute. I like my character a lot. Alright, let's let's go raid the slime all this, guys. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for uh, joining me on this test stream. Let's see if I can... There we go. Um, I appreciate you and I see you. And as always, guys, I want you to remember that you are loved, that you are important, and that you matter. Please always keep that in mind for me. Um, but yeah, until the next stream. Bye.